What can the Apple Vision Pro do? Well, a lot. Let's take a look. So the first thing you're gonna do, you see this little circle here? We're gonna use our index finger and we're gonna use our thumb and we're gonna go in ahead and pinch. This is going to bring up our app tray. We have Apple TV, Apple Music, got the Photos app, Safari, Mail, Messages. Same thing you find in the Apple ecosystem. So this video is not gonna be about productivity or any type of focus deep work or any type of BS like that. You find other videos like that. This is just a complete, a small overview of what the Apple Vision Pro can do. So we have all these different apps, all these different apps. We have your Word, Excel, and all of that. PowerPoint, IMAX. We have all these different apps that we can play with. So we're gonna go ahead and choose the Safari app. Let's go ahead and pinch. So as you see, let's move this out the way. We have a floating window. So Apple Vision Pro can place windows in your actual space. And you can resize them to any size that you want. Just to show you what that looks like, I'm standing up, I'm in my house, I'm gonna go ahead and we're going to walk around. So this is six degrees of freedom. Six degrees of freedom. That means you can walk behind it. Obviously you're not gonna see the content on the page, but that's all right. We're just gonna keep walking. And it's just a standing screen that is high def, HD inside your space. One thing that I noticed that Apple, that Apple did, each screen that's floating has its own shadow. You see the shadow? It's the small detail, but that right there brings out the immersion. It's awesome. So you can go ahead and just pinch and bring that with you and just leave it floating. You can interact with it. You can bring out another screen if you want. Let's go ahead and bring that up. So YouTube, you bring that up. And now you have two screens. So you have multiple screens. So I did a video on how many screens Apple Vision Pro can handle. And the answer is 32. Go ahead and check out that video. It's awesome. I have screens all over the place. But this is sick. So you can do multiple screens and just, just lay them all over your house. So let's go ahead and get rid of that one screen. I'm gonna show you how big a screen you can make. As high as you can go and just push it back some. So now you have a big gigantic screen. So can you picture watching YouTube on a screen like this? This is literally a wall size screen inside your house. And you watching Netflix, you can watch YouTube or just whatever you're watching, whatever you're into. That's just one of the many things. Safari app is quite amazing. It's the first thing that a lot of people use. Just wanna go ahead and showcase that. So now we're back in our, our app tray. So this is what Apple TV looks like. So you can go ahead and watch Apple TV. Not now, no notifications. Same thing, you can go ahead and place it and then choose a video of your liking as far as what you wanna do. So right here, I'm looking, I'm looking at the side and a, a, little, a little menu showed up. So you have your Apple TV Plus, which I don't have. I don't have Apple TV Plus. I need to get on that actually, so I can watch cool movies. And you have the vision. Let's go ahead and go to vision. So this right here. Now, due to copyright, Apple is real funny about letting us show what it looks like within vision but trust me when i tell you it's quite an experience i could say that it's quite an experience and i don't want to get copyright strike because youtube will copyright you <laughs> so i don't need them problems just trust me on that oh look at him he's so cute so that's apple tv you have all your different games you have your productivities like your word and excel your teams you have imax So you can watch IMAX on here as well. And same thing, same thing. We can't show you anything, of course. It's, it's definitely a pain in the butt. But you can watch IMAX on a very large screen as well. We have all the different, all the different games like Pluto TV works on here. It's just a really big screen. 
I'll show you a little something. I got I gotta give you something. Hold on. Bird egg? No, no, no. It's a tarot. Well, just like I thought, Pluto's gonna block that out as well, so we can't watch anything on there as well. Yeah, boo. That sucks. So we're gonna go and talk about games. So let's check out Ping Pong Club. Ooh. So Ping Pong Club, this is just a little game. We have a little ping pong table that's in our space. So we're gonna do a practice. And we're gonna practice our forehand, because why not? So now we have that. We have our ping pong table. And again, this is all in the digital space. It's amazing. See, look at that. Check that out. All digital space. Got a paddle. And we have a ball. Let's go ahead and hit it. I am trash. <laughs> so now we're going to go ahead and try it out. Yeah, I'm trash. Try it out one more time. Yeah, I'm really bad at this. Ugh. And now we're going to go ahead and try it out. And now <laughs> we're going to go try it out. Now we're going to try it out. All right, so you get the point. So that's ping pong. Ping pong is amazing. It keeps you busy. It will smoke you out for sure. It's, it's a lot. But again, this is sick. Like you can play ping pong in your space. And not only that, you can go ahead and change the location. So now, now that we're not in our living room kitchen anymore, now we're in some weird, deep, dank space. This is incredibly dank. But yup, ping pong's life. We're not gonna worry about the dankness or any monsters that's gonna come at any of these corridors. Quite creepy. But hey, we're gonna just keep playing some ping pong because why not? Yeah, I'm, I'm trash, I'm trash. But that's ping pong, it's awesome. So yes, the Vision Pro actually works with regular iPad apps. So that's what the more apps is. So more apps, you have your calendar app, so you can bring that up. So if you have any type of appointments, you can go and place that there. There are widgets for that, which I'll get to in a minute. You can also do your maps. So I don't know who would actually like, well, wear that Vision Pro just walking around and just having a map and it just walking to the destination. Please don't do that. That's a quick way to get robbed. Don't do that. Somebody will rob you. That's just weird. Okay? Don't do that. Another thing I'm going to go ahead and show, we have the news as well. So if you're a big news person, you want to go and see what's going on, like the latest. We have the Jimmy, Kim, Jimmy Kimmel to return to ABC on Tuesday after show's controversial suspension. That is actually good. This is not a political channel. I just want you to know that. But freedom of speech is freedom of speech. It is what it is. Like, come on, grow a pair. That's just what it is. And we also have X. I will not bring up X because X is no man's land. If you know anything about X, you know why. We're just gonna leave it at that. <laughs> X is no man's land, you never know. And also, you have Steam Link. So if you have a PC and you have Steam, you can use Steam Link and grab a controller and play your video games. So yes, Apple Vision Pro is so much more than just work. It's not about just work. It's about having fun as well. And a lot of people feel, I really feel like a lot of people forget that. So you want to make sure that you have a good time when you spend this much money on this piece of tech. If you can afford it, I absolutely recommend it because Apple continuity is key. And Vision Pro works very well with the MacBook Pro and the, the mouse as well. I did a whole nother video on that. If you wanna go and take a look at that, check that out as well. But yeah, that's pretty much in a nutshell. Oh, one more thing. <laughs> Sound like Tim Cook. One more thing. You have your environments. This right here is the amazing Mount Hood. It is quite nice. So amazing. 
This is one of many Apple's amazing environments. So you can sit here, you can do your work in a, such a serene area. You can even listen to the birds chirping if you would like. It's quite nice. Got the water babbling in the brooks. You got the amazing Mount Hood in the background. And if you want to go ahead and change it, you can change your location to all the many locations that we have. Like the very new one that just came out on Vision OS 26, that is Jupiter. Let's take a look at that. Check that out. So we on, let's go ahead and X this out. We are actually on one of Jupiter's many moons. So you got the big red spot, which all the massive hurricanes are located in that one spot, never ending. And you can just look around. How sick is this? So you can just teleport and check out all the different areas. So also what's cool about the environments, you can go ahead and change all the different, all the different types of day. So one thing about this right here, you can go ahead and change from daylight to nighttime, so on and so forth. So right now we are in afternoon, actually, excuse me, this is dawn and sunrise. And then you have night. So night's pitch black. I don't know if you can see, but all I see is stars and a giant like circle. And then you have, let's go ahead and bring a sunrise again. So you got the sun over there. You got just a little bit of Jupiter. And then you got afternoon, which is Jupiter in its full glory. So it does say that you can actually sit here in 24 hours and it'll cycle through the whole day. It's quite amazing. So, so yeah, you can do quite a bit with the Apple Vision Pro. You just got to just take the time to go and cycle through it. And it's not, again, it's not all about just work. If you can afford it, I highly recommend it. Just make sure that you're not foregoing rent and food to buy something like this. I recommend you saving your money for sure. This is Vision Play XR. I see you in the next one. Peace.